All right, guys, Aussie Mike strikes again. So I figured for an unboxing of some knives from Aussie Mike, I would use his TJ Fisher, TJ Fisher launch to open the box. Uh, and it happens to be a Friday, the day of filming. And so it's kind of Fisher Friday. So yeah, this thing cuts great. and just uh, awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, let's see what we got in here. This is... I know about one of them, and then there was a couple of others that he said he was sending also. So let's just get it all out of here. These actually came from Skypax. That's the freight forwarder that we use to go between the States and Australia. So sometimes he has knives shipped straight to there that I may have already seen, I may have already, you know, filmed or whatnot. And so... He doesn't always send them to me. He sends me most, but not all. And these ones, I actually was like, I think I made a comment about this guy of that I wanted to see one of these and film it because I saw these at Blade Show West. This is the um, Microtech Amphibious. Amphibian? Amphibious? What is it? Amphibian with the RAM lock. Okay. So he goes, oh man, I just bought one and I had it shipped straight to the forwarder. I got to play with one of these. Uh, my buddy Eric in Utah bought one. Now the Ram Lock is basically, uh, you know, Microtech's version of a bar lock, of the access lock, you know, what have you. <sighs> you know, I was not buying anything at Blade Show West. But this is one that's kind of cool. And I did think about maybe buying one because they were on a, they had a great deal at the show and all of that. They do come with partially serrated blades as well. And yeah, handling Eric's and whatnot was super cool. So I will have a full video on this shortly. We have some extra pocket clips that I'm not sure what they are for. Looks like there's a sticker in here. I don't know if it's for the Spartans or for the Knoll. Let's see. Um, because of that in there, I'm guessing it's for the Knoll knives. So let's just pull these out real quick and we'll do that next. All right, so we got some extra clips and thumb studs, it looks like. All right, let's take a look and see what that Knoll knife is. And it's like a drawer, it looks like. But there's no pull tab, like, what the heck? So packaging is important to me. I like packaging, I like cool packaging, but a drawer with no handle is kind of dumb. Oh, it's there, it's just in backwards. Okay, I take back my previous statement. All right, so this is all kind of in backwards. So this is the Null Knives Voodoo. A little bit of details about it. Uh, I'm not familiar with these. Okay, so we got a different clip and a different backspacer for when you put the clip in and then different thumb studs. So it's kind of like you go from black plain Jane to kind of a little bit of pop and flare with the Tymascus or heat treated titanium. I don't know. We'll find that out when I do the full video. This thing's actually pretty cool. Not my favorite blade shape. Uh, you know, eh. Cool knife, cool packaging. Maybe not my thing, but that's okay. And I am going to put it back in the normal way so that I don't have issues with it later. So now you do have a tab. Okay, cool. Spartan blades. Let's see, what do we got here? Um, Spartan Harsey Custom. Ooh, 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 Chad Nichols Damascus? What? Spartan Blade, Spartan Harsey in Damascus? Say it ain't true. Wow. I, I love the blade. I don't love these knives. I, I mean, I've done several videos on these knives over the years. 
and they're okay. Like they're just, I don't know. Something about them just isn't for me. Like I, do you guys ever have that? Like you can't really put your finger on why you don't like something. I get it. A lot of people are polarized by certain things and like, oh my God, that's just dumb. Like, you know, like the Hellraiser. A lot of people just go, oh my God, that's just dumb. I don't understand. Okay, I get it. I don't agree with you and you're wrong. And once you handle one in person, you'll probably change your mind. But I understand that if you just don't like something, but this I like, like everything about it, I kind of like, but I don't like, I don't know. I'm having a hard time with these. Um, and I've probably said that on those videos. This is super stiff because it's brand new still. Um, but the blade, man, is super cool. So Aussie Mike, very cool. Thank you for sending these in. This one, out of the out of the group here, yeah, this one's really it. Even over the null knife that I already kind of packed away nice and neat. Although, can you go wrong with a Fisher? I don't know. These are pretty cool. Super smooth action, carbon fiber throughout. Like, I, yeah. All right, stay tuned. I'll do full videos. And uh, there you go. Thanks a lot, guys.